Stryker. Curtis Stryker was the leader of the NYPD Special Riot Control Division. During Shao Kahn's attempt to seize Earthrealm, Stryker found himself among the Earth Warriors, charged with saving mankind. To this day, he still has no idea how or why he was called to defend his home. Stryker is one of the few warriors that is left behind in Earthrealm to help defeat Shao Kahn and stop his invasion. Stryker was some people's favorite character and a lot of people's least favorite character in Mortal Kombat 3. Um, he was probably the most um, uh, urban, less superhero looking character that we've had in a Mortal Kombat game before that because it looked like he was just kind of wearing street clothes. You know, he had a backwards cap on, he was like this cop, but he really didn't look futuristic or anything. And so a lot of people kind of looked at him in terms of the visuals and you know they were, they didn't uh, they weren't attracted over in terms of, of picking him, but if you actually picked the character, he was one of like the best hidden secrets in Mortal Kombat 3, where he was actually one of the strongest characters, and especially in Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3, when he was given his gun move, I think he was easily in the top five most powerful characters. <laughs> Striker was never really a big fan favorite, so the challenge for Armageddon was trying to make him look cool and make those people like Striker. Striker has a lot of cool moves this game. He has a taser, he has bombs again, but he just has a sleeker, cooler look. Yeah! 